You must tell me, amateurs have always played a major part, and they still do. For example, amateurs do things professional divers don't want to do, haven't time to do, or can't do. I mean, the average amateur knows the sky a great deal better than the average professional. So, amateurs discover comets, novae, and so on. One of our amateurs, Tom Bowles, who's now discovered over 100 supernovae in external galaxies. He can look out for them. That's the kind of thing the amateur can do. I say, in my young days, rather different, I was one of the many people who are mapping the moon. We've done that now, we've moved on, but nevertheless, amateurs are there, always have been, and certainly today, amateur astronomy is as important as it's always been, probably more so. And of course, the moon men I know, Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, all the others, and they're great people. And they're not the same. I mean, after all, Neil and Buzz, the first two men on the moon, they're different, they're different kinds of people. Neil is quiet and retiring. Buzz, in the best sense of the word, is a publicist. But um, they were very, very first two men on the moon.